Hello. This is Mr. Holmes. <clears throat> this is him. Hey, this is Ashley from the Attorney General's office. We talked the other day. Uh, yes, ma'am. I just want to let you know that um, I've talked to my superiors, and um, they said that we do not have any jurisdiction over this matter, and that what you'll need to do is contact DHR legal. Well, that, well, that's, well, that's just it, that uh, they don't have jurisdiction over this matter either. And uh, if anybody would have jurisdiction within the state, it would be the Attorney General. Um, and uh, But we're claiming that, you know, not only uh, have, are they violating our civil rights, uh, constitutional rights, but we don't live in the state of Alabama, nor do we choose to live in the state of Alabama. And these people are trying to use coercion and conversion tactics and extortion tactics. Uh, to make us stay here in the state of Alabama, all at the expense of our family. Uh, they had no probable cause, no pickup warrant. Uh, every single person on the stand said there was no emergency, and our child has not been returned yet. So there's only one conclusion here, is that somebody's paying top dollar for our child or something more sinister is at, is at play. And we need help. We have a lot of... We have a lot of over, I mean, it goes to DHR legal. So I was I was told by the district attorney here uh, that the next stage up after him would be uh, y'all, and that uh, that ultimately uh, that DHR's attorneys uh, they function out of y'all's office or under y'all's office, uh, and that uh, they um, do not. They are their own separate agency. Um. So they. We, we're not over. Oh, I'm talking about the uh, prosecutor for them. Right, but our office, they, their prosecutors or their attorneys are under DHR. They work for DHR. They don't work for the attorney general's office. Well, they they're called assistant attorney generals, but they don't work for us. Well, what does that mean, assistant attorney general? That's just their title. They're a prosecutor for the state of Alabama, so they're called an assistant attorney general. They work for DHR and are under DHR policy. And, and, attorney, and attorney, the attorney general is the state, right? Right. All right. So our our claim here is is what evidence for facts uh, does the DHR have that they have jurisdiction over our family? We have not been given that. And, and like said, we don't have. We can't help you with that. It's DHR. Um. So when do we get any relief from a from um, color of law acts where you have a supervisor inside of uh, the DHR here uh, that's acting out of color of law and 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 malicious intent and judges that are that are openly uh, okay with violating our civil rights? Uh, where does one get relief? <clears throat> You'll have to talk to a private attorney about that. Private attorneys don't. Uh, uh, they can do maybe lawsuits and stuff like that, but what we're looking for is relief uh, to to get our child back because of uh, because of people using the the government wrongfully, the authority of it. Private attorney, and you'll need to talk to DHR legal. Okay, uh, there's nothing our office can do to assist. Um. Well. I think that y'all can. I just, I just, I think that uh, we're being sidebarred once again. But I think that y'all really can. Like I said, I've talked to my supervisors, and and that's what they instructed me on is that we do not have any jurisdiction. Well, and that the HR legal did. Okay. Well, well, well. Watch this real quick. Watch. You're saying that y'all or that your bosses are saying that they don't have any jurisdiction. Well, what give, well, what gives DHR and their attorney's jurisdiction over us? Sir, I am not an attorney. Do you see? Do you see? Do you see what I'm saying? But why? Why do I even need to talk? Why do I even need to speak to them? Uh, we haven't broken any. We haven't broken any laws. Uh, they're in control of this. I know that, but but how did they get in control of something like this? When when there is no uh, uh, there's no consent from us. Uh, there's no laws that have been broken. How did they get control over my family? I don't know. I don't know anything about the case. That is their case. You'd have to talk to them about it. I do not know. 
All right, but DHR are not oath keepers. And I can't, and they're I can't, not they're not oath keepers. They're not oath keepers of the law. And they're, they're just a private organization that functions uh, within uh, this judicial system, what's called the judicial or the or state system. Uh, they get paid by the same people that you get paid from. Uh, so to, for all these people to say that nobody can do something to me is, is, a, is, is a ruse, a ruse or whatever you want to call it. Um, and we we need we need some help. We need we need our family uh, back together. Our child uh, was given to us by God, and no one else. And he's not the property of Alabama. And we need our child back. And he needs to be with his parents. Now we haven't broken any crimes, um, and uh, we were migrating through the state of Alabama. We don't live here, so the attorney general would be the head of the state, and we need some relief. And like I said, we do not have any jurisdiction. So would they would, the HR will go and talk to a private attorney. Okay? All right, well, let me ask you this real quick. What what is it going to do whenever I talk to a DHR um, attorney that's supposed to uh, that's supposed to protect them and not us? Whenever I approach them about uh, fraudulent papers of two pickup orders, uh, a petition uh, with false claims on it, uh, our child being picked up before there was even a pickup order signed. Uh, fraudulent uh, signatures on on other paperwork. What what what? Why would I speak to the people that are doing all these things against us? Why would they help me? Why would they help our family? Sir, you would have to ask a private attorney that question. That would would be who would represent you. You can talk to DHR because they have your case. I don't know what they can tell you. I don't know anything about your case than to what you told me, so I can't speak to what well, happened in your case, evidence, whatever. You'll have to talk to DHR legal about it, and you'll have to get a private attorney to assist you in it. Well, the problem with getting private attorneys uh, is that they all become compromised. Uh, and uh, unless you have a lot of money to pay an outside attorney to come in that's not afraid of being disbarred, uh, then that's about the only way you can deal with the DHR system. Uh, this, has been, this has become a very dictatorship and authoritative abuse with DHR. And, uh, and uh, to try and find an attorney um, to help us properly without telling us that uh, trying to get us to submit um, to their coercion and conversion tactics is very difficult. Uh, we haven't found one yet. So that's what we're running into. So that's why we're having to handle this ourselves uh, because there is no attorney that can uh to see, that can stand up to them uh without i don't know breaking you down can do or it every day. no actually I, I don't see i've never uh i've never seen any attorney that takes on um uh dhr it's all over the internet to where um what was that um uh, the turnover effect once dhr gets involved uh, it, it, there's a there's a high rate of where they keep um, the children instead of turning it over because of uh, not wanting to admit uh, or to the wrongful intent. Okay. Sir, we're not getting anywhere. Yeah. I have told you what our office said we cannot do. We we don't have jurisdiction. Um, so let's just end it there, okay? All right. Well, uh, I I guess that. The same way that y'all or y'all are claiming to not have jurisdiction is the same way that they should not have jurisdiction to us, and that's what we're going to claim in court because uh, they they shouldn't have no jurisdiction over us either if y'all don't have jurisdiction either. So that's what we're going to that'll, that'll be our statement. Okay. Alrighty. Thank you. All right, bye.